Minister of the FCT, Nyesam Wike, has lashed out at persons criticizing the intervention of President Bola Tinubu in the political crisis in River State. The governor, uh, the former governor, broke his silence on the peace deal at a Thanksgiving service for the former commissioner for works, Alabo George Kelly. Senior reporter Uchi Okoro has the details. <laughs> Mr. George Curley served as commissioner for works under former governor Yesom Wike. He recently resigned from Governor Seminar Lai Fubara's cabinet. Yes, he is thanking God for the journey so far in his personal life and political career. The FCT minister led other political leaders in the state to attend the service. He used the opportunity to speak about President Bola Tinubu's intervention in the recent political development for the first time. We must thank Mr. President for interfering and intervening. But I was not the one who invited Mr. President. You were the one, President intervened. President intervened. President has not intervened. He has no constitutional power. You are the one who said president should uh, intervene. And president has intervened to bring peace. He now turned around that no, he does not have the constitutional uh, power. Mr. Wike promised to tow the path of peace as brokered by the president. I, no matter what circumstances, president invites me to a meeting and tells me to do something. Within 24 hours, I'll carry it out. Because not only as president, but I have subjected myself to the peace uh, process. And if you ask, what is everybody shouting? Some of you do not even know that Mr. President had invited us privately and said, do this, do this, do this, do this. And you agreed. Before Mr. President, and you didn't do it. Healing will return to Nigeria. Yeah. Prayers were offered for the stability of the country and for the success of President Bola Tinubu and other political leaders. Uche Okoro, TVC News, Port Harcourt.